What's up, y'all? I'm Rachel Haditsis. I'm a realtor with EXP in Murfreesboro, Tennessee. In this video, I'm going to talk about the insane growth that has been happening in Murfreesboro, Tennessee, and what the next few years is expected to look like. Make sure you stick around until the very end because I'm going to tell you why people are moving here in the first place. First, let's talk about when Murfreesboro started growing. More than 40 years ago, Rutherford County, where Murfreesboro is located, was mostly farmland. Starting in the 80s and 90s is when that started changing. As time has gone on in Rutherford County, but especially in Murfreesboro, farmland is being developed. We have over 37,000 acres within the city, with over 26,000 acres utilized. The city estimates that about 67% of the development in the city is residential. If you look at the Murfreesboro city limits, you'll see there's not really a pattern. The city has annexed portions of the county in a very scattered manner over the years, but it is expected to fill in the gaps in the future. Nearly 40% of the homes in Murfreesboro were built between 1980 and 1999 during a huge population growth. To date, our city has gained over 100,000 residents since the 1990s. The recent 2020 census estimates that Murfreesboro has over 160,000 people. School enrollment has increased over 45% in the last 25 years. Some may say that the traffic here is bad or that school enrollment is pushing its limits, but change is not always linear. Our city is looking at the way our land is currently being used and evaluating what needs to happen to support the expected population growth. So what is expected to happen to Murfreesboro over the next few years? To learn more about what the next few years will bring, I looked at the Murfreesboro 2035 Comprehensive Plan. I'll leave a link to that down in the description. Basically, it's a 20-year plan for the city's growth and development. The city approved it in 2017. It answers the question, how will our land be used? When you check out the website, you'll see a guide for the community that lays out specific policy, program, and project initiatives for the city. It includes things like transportation, land use, housing and neighborhoods, parks and recreation, public facilities, historic preservation, and economic development. The overall plan is focused on two things, population growth and infrastructure. Because in the next 10 to 15 years, our city is expected to gain another 100,000 people and maybe even more. The projected estimate from the city is that in 2035, our city will have between 230,000 and 360,000 residents. So why are people moving here? People will move for any number of reasons, but I think a lot of it has to do with just wanting to live out the American dream. The areas surrounding Nashville, especially Murfreesboro, are rich with job growth. That's a big reason why many are moving to the area. If a job isn't bringing you to the area, possibly it's an educational opportunity. You may move to the area to be closer to family, or maybe you wanna move here because of the school systems. You may move here to start a business, or maybe you'll move here to retire. Murfreesboro offers a unique opportunity to feel like you're living in a mid-sized city, but have all the conveniences of a larger city, like the major hospitals we have close by, high-speed internet, and quick access to the airport. Murfreesboro is the geographic center of Tennessee. It makes our city perfect for things like hosting events. As the Gateway Shopping Area gets developed, our city expects to be hosting many more conferences and events in the future. Although we have a lot more people than we did 40 years ago, Murfreesboro still does not have those big city vibes. People here will still make eye contact with you and still strike up a friendly conversation. I won't promise that everyone you meet will be like that, but the good majority of us are. Murfreesboro is not just growing, our city is thriving and progressing. If you live here in Murfreesboro and you don't like all the changes in big city growth that's happening, maybe it's time to consider selling your property. Now is the perfect time to get top dollar while our home values are at their highest levels ever. 
My website and contact information are down in the description if you'd like a free home valuation. Tap that like button if you learned something new today and make sure to subscribe with the bell so you'll be the first to know when I post a new video. I've got so much more to tell you about life and real estate in the Murfreesboro area and beyond. So I'll see you at the next video.